and motivator Speak nothing but the truth Tell them how my life was through My life was up and down That's why I'm speaking now Look at my YouTube page I'm gonna motivate you when you had them bad days Hey, 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 It's your boy J. Michael with another V I D E O. Man, forget all that. Let's get on down to this video. Hit that subscribe button, the dislike button, the notification bell, the like button, however y'all feel. Just keep it real, the real in there sway. But let's dive on in this. Y'all see what's been going on with Mucker, Latoya, Erica, Cry. Y'all been seeing this. J. Michael been staying really staying neutral much as I could because I was on something else with some other other ignorant people that was on the YouTube streets, in the YouTube streets, you know, I was on their top. But you know, that, that one ignorant person got on they live like I knew they was gonna do, cause they ignorant like that, you know what I'm saying? Y'all gonna learn about them people eventually, you know? When y'all gonna understand realness? This ain't all about show all the time. This ain't all about entertainment all the time. Yeah, you have some folks on here entertaining, that's what they do, they have fun. But then you have some folks on here being real ignorant, real disrespectful. And then throwing out the, throwing, trying to throw out dirty laundry. When y'all be on here sharing stuff with people, thinking they y'all friends. Y'all be on here, oh yeah, man, you know, I, I, I've I been through not the, oh, oh. But then that same person get on here and air y'all dirty laundry out. Because they want to get views. When y'all going to learn, everybody on this net ain't y'all friends. It's all about the dollars. It's all about the views. It's all about the subscribers. They don't give a damn about your life. I try to share my life with y'all because I know I'm not the only one that's going through something out there in the world. And sometimes people need to know they're not the only one. So you need to share your testimony sometimes. Share your journey in life with people that need to hear that so they can feel confident about their self. That's why I share the things I share. They want to talk about my manhood. I'm not embarrassed about my manhood because if I was embarrassed about my manhood, I wouldn't have never spoke on it. You get what I'm saying? You can't embarrass me. But let's 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 go on and get into this 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 what's going on. First, mucker. You can eventually have a multi-million dollar business if you stop wasting your petty time with these two inner jackals. You wasting your time. You keep throwing these petty shots. You keep nitpicking because of what? They picking, they throwing shots. So what? You a grown man, player. If they want to do that, let them do that. Everybody know what they're about. You need to step your game up and eliminate yourself from that. Then you get on here and you say, I got my lawyers. I got this. I got that. Why are you getting mad? Why are you airing your business out there that you got attorney? You don't never tell your right hand what your left hand is doing. You don't need sympathy from these YouTube streets. You don't need that player. These people don't know you player. Get out your body, man. You a grown man that's making money, that's building a real estate company up, player. You shouldn't give a damn about how you and Latoya got together, so what? Y'all happy, right? Unless that's fake. Because if you're happy, you shouldn't worry about what Tom, Dick, and Harry is saying. Because y'all happy, y'all content, y'all building, y'all moving forward. So why move backwards entertainment, Tom, Dick, and Harry, player? Huh? Help me understand that. Let me give you a prime example. You say you got a real estate company. You got 40-something people under you. 
But you won't hear going tit for tat, back and forth, woo woo, ah ah, whatever you want to call it. You going back and forth on this, on this platform. But not say some of your employees see that. Right? Some of your employees see that. Oh, our boss going nuts. But then say you get on the internet and you see one of your employees doing something stupid. What can you say? Nothing. Because you won't here doing the same thing, player. You got to lead by example. And you a boss. So be a boss. If you say you got this real estate company, you don't need YouTube, player. YouTube is beneath you. If you making money with these houses. YouTube is a good platform to make money if this is what people want to do to get easy money. And put a little change in their pocket. But to become a millionaire, you got to stay constantly doing this. You got to be motivated to do this. This got to be your dream. This has got to be your job if you want to be a YouTube legend. But if you're just doing this to make ends and ends meet and, and pennies and stuff like that, okay. But according to you, my baby, you don't need this. You don't need this $500, that $1,000. You don't need that. So why get on here and waste your time, pal? Because to the people, it's like you lying. To the people, it's like you're not this real estate mogul. Because if you're this real estate mogul, you wouldn't be on here going back and forth like Mike Tyson punch out. You wouldn't give a damn what people say about you on this internet because don't nobody know you. So why worry about how they feel? Huh? Then you put that thing under there, do not use my video, I bet not see this, I bet not see that. Why? Why? I mean, I ain't gonna even lie in the beginning. When people used to do that, I used to get in my body because I didn't understand it. I did YouTube, but it was for entertainment. I was just rapping and doing little skits. But when I started getting involved in this crap, and people was going in hard, I was like, what? Oh, hell no. But then I had to learn. They like me. They gonna voice their opinion. It might not be as like mine. Some gonna go hard in the paint. Some gonna go mild in the paint. Some gonna agree with you. Everybody's not gonna see what you see. Everybody not gonna speak it the way you speak it. Everybody not gonna agree the way you agree. So why get mad and say they can't use your video? Let them. They can do whatever. They can make men's about me because all they doing is boosting you up, my baby. They boosting you up, plow. So why not let people use your video? Oh, because they say ignorant stuff. They disrespect it. They making me mad. You a grown man, plow. I hope that ain't you. So I'm going to say that's Latoya getting in her body. Yeah, that's Latoya getting in her body. Because she is a female. Females are very emotional. You see? And then, you know, she's in the background. I heard it too. You better check that B. Latoya. Latoya, 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 Latoya. How many times do I have to make a video? You a grown woman. Note that. Mucker, you a grown man. Note that. But y'all becoming successful. Erica is ignorant. You know what? Let me take that back. I ain't gonna even call that girl ignorant. Erica is an opportunist. And every each and one of y'all falling into her trap. Erica is an opportunist. She don't care who she hurt. She don't care who she stuck on. Long as she come out on top. Long as everybody believe her antics, her shenanigans. She don't care what pieces she got to move on that chessboard. Long as she get the right pieces on the side. 
Y'all don't see that? That girl is not dumb by a long shot. That girl know how to manipulate the system. And so what she did when she was manipulating the system, she done brought it to YouTube. Now she manipulating YouTube and the people that's on YouTube to get that money, to get those views, to get those subscribers. Because why? <clears throat> she seen the money that you can make off YouTube from the Prince family, from, from M.M. and Vaughn, from Cryer, from other people she didn't met. So she know what she can make on YouTube. And she's been around long enough to know drama and BS sells. People don't want to hear that motivational stuff. You have some people do, but it take a little longer because you got to get the right fan base to, to, to flock. You got to get your fans to tell other people to come to your channel to listen to your motivation. But when they come to drama, you ain't got to tell nobody. All they got to be is one person say, man, go to such and such page, man, they going in. Or they got to see the title. Ooh, they in there. Now you got 20, 30, 40,000 subscribers, I mean, views. But when, you, when you're trying to speak consciousness, realness, Facts, motivation. You might get what? A thousand? You might get two thousand? That's if you're a lower platform. Now, if you're a higher, bigger platform, you might get ten thousand, fifteen thousand, compared to twenty to thirty thousand if it was drama. And ever could know that. How many times y'all have seen? Ever could get on here crying, saying, I'm gonna do this, I'm done, I'm gonna leave everybody alone, I'm just gonna focus on me and my kids. But then, yet, two days later, oh, fuck these motherfuckers, that, 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 that. or she'll, she'll give y'all the heads up, I'm finna be petty. I'm finna be petty. Who know they finna be petty and be petty? A person that don't have morals or value about they self as a woman. A woman that had a messed up childhood but don't know how to, to convert that to something positive. To women that's, the, that's like her, to women that's younger than her, to some women that's older than her that she can tell them, girl, I've been through that. You see, I overcame it. Don't tell them what you've been through and then come on here with the BS. Being a hypocrite saying, play, playing tug of war, playing tug of war with yourself. You have little girls out there, teenage girls out there that look up to you. So why you won't lead? Don't lead by YouTube. Don't lead by views. Don't lead by subscribers. Lead by being a woman. Lead by being a mother. Lead by being an inspirational speaker. Lead by being a woman that been through something that came over, that overcame it, and now she's rising to become a successful woman. Lead by that. Don't lead by these shenanigans on YouTube. Don't lead by because you want people to feel sorry for you. Lead by being that woman that ever could know she can be. If ever could know she can be that. But Erica got to take that mask off. Erica got to take that veil off. Erica got to take that helmet off. Erica got to open up that heart and take that malice out her heart and that hatred out her heart and that bitterness out her heart and be that woman that God know you can be. And that's real. Because you sitting here playing with this man, with this child. All that man asked for was a DNA. So what? So what? That this man with Latoya, you went back to Mr. Cry. Cactus here. You see what I'm saying? Again and again, how many times I got to say it? All four of y'all, the four horsemen, playing y'all tit for tat. 
But at the end of the day, the full horsemen's, y'all grown folk. Y'all grown folk. Them is innocent babies. Them is innocent babies. That y'all putting into y'all shenanigans. Baby Mocker, Baby Dia, and Gary Young. Them innocents. They innocent. They innocent. What baby mucker got to do with Latoya? What baby mucker got to do with Cactus Head Cry? What baby mucker got to do with Latoya? Because you don't want baby mucker around Latoya? That's going to be his wife. You got baby mucker around Cactus Head Cry? So what's the difference? If that man want to get a DNA, let that man get a DNA. That's benefiting you. That's helping you. So why would you get in your body because that man want to get a DNA and y'all keep saying this man is not being a father. This man is not doing that. Why would I want to be a father to somebody that's being ignorant? So what I'm going to do is bypass all that ignorance and that stupidness and that craziness and go straight to court. So now I'm going to get my visitation rights. So now you have nothing to say when I come to try to be a father to my son. You see, he doing it the right way. Forget all this playing games with you. You and Cactus Head cry. Forget playing these games. I'm going to go to court. Since you want to play with my son, I'm going to go to court. And now let's see what you say to the courts when they give me my visitation rights. All the man asked for was a DNA. All the man is saying is he don't want to play these, keep playing these kid games. Just tit for tat with your child. So get a man what he wants. A DNA. So he can say, this is my son. Now I'm going to take care of my responsibility. That's all he's saying. So why is you going around the corner, jumping gates, running through the back door, climbing the roof, climbing the pole, jumping off the pole into the swimming pool just to get this man the DNA? Huh? Nah. And baby Dion, that's your son. That's you and Cactus Head Cryer, excuse me, son. Cactus Head, you know how you felt when baby Dion was around Mucker. You didn't like that at all. And I'm not just saying this just to be saying this. I know firsthand but we're going to leave that alone. I know firsthand that you didn't like that. You felt that was disrespectful. It bothered you. It hurted your feelings. So how do you think this man feel with the same woman that played you with baby Dion? The same woman is playing the same dang on games with baby Mucker. You not no stupid man. You not no dummy. What do this chick got on you that you can't shake her, bro? Huh? You 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 can't be that in love. You can't be that in love. You see? You let this woman disrespect your child, Darion. And I know what y'all saying. That ain't got nothing to do with you, J. Michael. Won't you let that? Won't you let them handle what they gonna handle? That's between them, J. J. Michael. That's where y'all wrong. If his dad's not going to be a protector, that's 
what he got a stepdad for. And one thing about me, my kids, my stepkids, I don't give a damn who it is. I'm going to go to war for mine. I'm going to go to war by any means necessary when it comes to my kids. And, 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 and you know what bothers me? Cactus head cry. And you know what bothers me? Cactus head cry. It's the fact that you know beyond a reasonable doubt that she said that. I told you. Your ex-wife told you. Because she heard it. I heard it. So what did I do? Study me getting on the internet. I went to her and told her, you need to call Darion's dad and address this. Then you make a video and say it out your own mouth in so many words that she said it. What is going to take for you to understand, man? Your kids is going to be your kids. You don't want to lose your children love. You don't want to lose the respect that your children give you. For a female that really don't give a damn about you. You sitting there saying, she's sitting there saying, Oh, J. Michael, you don't know what you're talking about. I love, I love Damien. I love Damien. Man, you don't know. You better quit talking about my baby mama, man. You better quit talking about my baby mama, man. Or it's going to be something, man. I love Erica. No, you don't. You probably got love for her. She probably got love for you. But the love y'all claim y'all have, that's not real. Because both of y'all are opportunists. You knew you was running out of stuff to do. Her page was going down. Y'all knew if y'all put each other back together, it was going to stir up the pot, the beef stew pot. And people were like, oh, she left Mucker and went back to cry. Uh oh, this is going to get good. Y'all know what y'all are doing. Y'all know it's going to bring them checks. <clears throat> See, right now, cry, you probably went down to probably five, three to five thousand dollars. But now you back, you probably back up to ten, fifteen thousand dollars a month now, if not more. Erica was getting nothing. She probably was getting a hundred dollars, two hundred dollars. Now she's back up to probably seven, eight thousand dollars now. Y'all ain't dumb. Y'all ain't stupid. I'm gonna get y'all the credit on that. Y'all ain't dumb by a long shot when it comes to this YouTube because you learned by the best your son, Damon. And you ain't dumb to the streets. So you know how to manipulate situations too. But to get on here and let that woman disrespect your son, you still let that woman face something wrong with you. Wow. That boy loves his dad. But don't make that boy choose between you and that girl. That boy, you shouldn't have to choose between your son and that girl. You should never put your son in a situation that he's not comfortable in. Never. Come on, man. I know what you're saying. I know what y'all saying. Oh, J. Michael being disrespectful. J. Michael trying to cop. Nah, player. I'm trying to keep it 100 the real in this way to all y'all. What y'all got going on? This shouldn't be entertainment for these kids, these people out there, and these kids, because y'all have kids that watch y'all channel. This shouldn't be entertainment. If y'all want to make a reality show, won't one of y'all get in touch with some networks and make y'all own reality show and bring it real? Don't mess up the YouTube brand with y'all personal lives. Come on. Just like you, Erica, you 
you rush baby mother to the hospital. Or one of the kids, because I didn't watch the video, somebody told me. That was something private. That didn't deserve no attention. That didn't deserve no sympathy from the people in the street. Oh, I had to rush my baby to the hospital. For what? Something is just meant for you and them kids and your dude. Not for the world. You not no celebrity. That you want to get all of the attention. Oh, Erica, we, we, we hope you're going to be all right. We, we feel sorry, girl. We praying for you, girl. Come on now. You, you drive on that. You thrive on that. You love it. But the kids don't need to be in it. The kids need to stay neutral. Now, if you're doing little going shopping, buying the baby stuff, stuff like that, yes. If they taking their first walk, okay, yes. But personal stuff needs to stay personal. Everything ain't meant for attention. You could have just put a community post up and said, can y'all pray for me and my baby? And that's it. You didn't have to film each moment or moment. You're not a big, big platform. But to you, you think you is. To you, you don't care. Like I said, you just want that attention. And you don't care how you get it. Y'all playing with fire. Well, they playing with fire because you the volcano. Latoya. Why is you lowering, lowering your standards to go back and forth with a person you know beyond a reasonable doubt is a liar, is a manipulator, is a shit starter? You was with Cryer when she was calling and texting and you seen it firsthand. This ain't nothing somebody telling you. You witnessed it. You was involved in it. So why would you stoop that low to be going back and forth with somebody that you know that's ignorant? But you claim you're a woman. You claim you're a godly woman. So why play these games? Because you want the views, because you want the subscribers, because you know what kind of money you can make because you was around crier and you seen what can be done on this YouTube because you had a YouTube long time ago, Mucker had a YouTube long time ago and it wasn't doing nothing, but now y'all meet these two people, now y'all page is doing numbers, so that's what it is. Be honest, keep it 100 real in this way. People respect y'all more if y'all just say, hey. We getting money. This is our way in, and we seize the opportunity. Be 100, the real your next way. Because at the end of the day, y'all got kids involved in all this. All this. Cryer. I know something wrong. And I know for a fact something is wrong. And you saying, ain't nothing wrong, dog. I don't know what you're talking about. When you start cussing your fans, when people leave comments and you're going back and forth with people in the comments, that ain't your MO. Anytime somebody address Erica, you get on here and put your Captain Saber whole suit on. Come on, man. That ain't your MO. And, 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 the, and the bigger thing that people not paying attention to, you chose Erica over Damon. And you don't let nothing come between you and the Prince family, my player. My player, you don't let nothing come between you and the Prince family. And you know how he feels. Again, I'm going to say it. You can't sit there and say you in love. 
this chick left you, had a whole nother baby by another dude, your so-called enemy, and now back with you with your so-called enemies, child. Ain't that much love in the world, player. That much love in the world. And I'm going to even go deeper than that. I know for a fact, beyond a reasonable doubt, you love Mama Selena. Mama Selena put up with a lot of your BS, but you never left Mama Selena. But then you claim Mama Selena messed around and cheated on you, and you left. That's why you left. And you ain't had nothing else to do with her. This chick left you, cheated on you, and had a baby on you. Help me make sense of that, man. Huh? Help me make sense of what I just said. Hmm? What you said on your video and what Mucker said on his video, y'all both damn near was saying not quite the same thing, but y'all was in the ballpark. But anybody say something about Erica? You going in that phone booth. Da, 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 da. You see? But Erica can say and do whatever she wants to people. Disrespect people however she wants to disrespect people. You ain't got nothing to say. But then as soon as they say something about Erica, Erica comes to you. Oh, they said this about me. Nobody told this about me. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You like, da, 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 da. Here I come to say the whole. Come on, man. Come on, man. Just like my video, you gonna make a video talking about I was disrespecting her. I wasn't disrespecting her, man. I was just giving my opinion like everybody else do. You see? Y'all need to grow up and leave this stuff alone. Because all y'all doing is making the situation worse and worse and worse than what it is already. And y'all got these three innocent children involved in this. The reason I said three, because Cam was never nothing in this. Because what nothing said about Cam. But baby Mucker, baby Dion, and Darion, be that woman you know you can be. Be that wife that you know you can be. Your past is your past, so what? Everybody got a past. Some got skeletons, some got dinosaur bones. Be that woman. Mucker, be that real estate mogul that you trying to be. Stay off the internet with this BS. Quit sending stuff to people. Stirring up the pot. Focus on what you need to do for your company. Fight for your son. If you have to do it in the courts, do that. Fight for your son. You ain't got to deal with her. Until you feel you ready until the courts gave you everything you need to do, step back. Stay, stay sitting down and silent until you, get, until you get the courts involved. Ain't nothing wrong with that because you're not trying to put yourself in harm's way. You're not trying to put your child in harm's way and you're not trying to put them in no harm's way because you never know what can happen. Anything can turn sour real quick. So if you feel you need to do it the right way, the legal way, then you do that, brother. Don't listen to these people on here like, oh, he's not being the father. We know he wasn't being the father. He wasn't doing this. How many times y'all have heard this man say, I want a DNA? So that make him not being a good father? Because he said he wanted DNA? What's wrong with that? So that make that man a bad father. And trust me, I'm not on his side. I'm not taking up for him. I'm just looking at the logical sense. Y'all are not giving that man an opportunity or a chance to be a father because he want to go through the courts? Ain't nothing wrong with that. I'm not going to keep giving this girl money and I can't see my child. But I'm constantly feeding her. No. He's doing it the right way. Cryer, <clears throat> I know Erica is your woman. You love Erica. You and Erica building something. But you need to take a back seat. And that Erica and Mucker 
handle what they need to handle with baby mucker. Just like, like I said in a, a previous video, you didn't like how mucker was playing family man with baby Dion. Now you see how the tables turn and now you playing daddy with baby mucker. You think it's cute. You think it's funny. You think it's hilarious. You think it's get back. It's that tit for tat with you. In numbers and views. But that's still an innocent child. That's in a game that he don't even understand what's going on because of these grown folk. Y'all all need to stop playing this. BS games and lead them children out of it. Because again, I don't care who it is. I would go to war for my kids and my stepkids. And this that's that ain't no threat. But when it comes to my kids, I will go to war. And I will defend them. And since Darion ain't got nobody defending him, I'm going to step up and I'm going to defend him. And then you sit there and you say you needed proof. That woman told Mucker the same thing. Mucker said, I wanted to call you so bad, J. Michael, and tell you that. But I didn't know how you was going to react to that. He said, I wanted to tell you that a long time ago. What she said about Darion. De De and then my guy Moji showed the proof. Showed the proof. You know, you might not know Moji personally, but one thing you know about Moji Cryer is that dude staying on his word. That dude try to speak the facts much as he can. So you know that man wasn't lying. Again, me and you might not see eye to eye, but you know I'm not finna play with Darion. You know that. You believe everything that come out of that girl's mouth like it's gold, like it hold the ocean. When you gonna wake up, what, when it's too late? When you lost everything? Then you gonna get back on here and be like, I should have listened to everybody? Because it's coming. It's just a matter of time before that C4 or that TNT blow up. And ain't nobody gonna lose but you, man. Because you're thinking with emotions and not looking at the logic. Mr. Cry, you a few years away from 60. You're not a teenager no more. You're not in your 20s, man. Everybody want to make money. Everybody want to be successful. But it's a way about doing things. Y'all ain't got to stump and push and crumble everybody just to get on top. Especially putting the kids in the middle of this war that shouldn't even be a war. Mucker, Latoya, Erica, Prior, when y'all going to say enough is enough? Because at the end of the day, Cryer, Erica, Mucker, Latoya, y'all going to have to deal with each other. Because of those kids. Well, really one. And that's baby Mucker. Because baby Dion ain't got to be around Latoya and Mucker. You with his dad. But baby Mucker got to be around Latoya and Mucker.
And if you're going to be with Cryer, it's going to be some times you're going to pull up in the car with Cryer. So y'all going to see each other. Y'all going to be around each other. Picking up that baby. But y'all not going to be happy until somebody seriously get hurt or somebody's reputation is seriously damaged. And then that's going to bring the beast out of somebody. Y'all not going to be happy. Subscribers, views, it's not that important. Money, it's not that important. When you have innocence involved, it's not. It's too much going on in the world as it is. But y'all want to keep these innocent babies in the middle of this bullshit y'all got going on. Come on. Enough is enough. Y'all done talked about each other every which way y'all can. How, how low do y'all want to make each other feel? What? Y'all want to see who can, who, who can get the most people to say, Ooh, ah, ooh, she came back hard. Oh, man, y'all see what he did? Oh, man, he going crazy. That's what y'all That's what y'all want? Y'all get a drive, a thrill off of that? Come on. Y'all get a thrill of how y'all see these people react to y'all videos. Y'all get a thrill on seeing how many people gonna be on your side and how many people gonna be against you. Do that turn y'all on? Come on. Everybody know J. Michael the Rillionaire. Some like me, some just watch me, some in the bushes, some love me. But they gonna know I'm gonna try to keep it real as I can. And if I'm wrong, I apologize. I don't sit there and be, oh well, it ain't it was here, huh? I don't let my pride get in the way. But all y'all wrong. All y'all is wrong. All y'all throwing shots at each other that's don't that don't even make sense. All y'all passing information on the people to get people involved. For what? Because at the end of the day, how these people get these recordings? They don't know you. They don't know Toya. They don't know Erica. They don't know Cryer. They don't even know Mucker. So how these people that don't even know them get this information? Because y'all sliding it to them. But y'all want to sit back in the cut like y'all ain't did nothing. But people with logical common sense know y'all passing this information on to these T-channels. I let them do my dirty work. But come on, man. It's time out. It's time out. It's time to go back to the skits. It's time to go back to the series. It's time to go back to help people get motivated. Because y'all have people that's really out there that's going through stuff. That look up to y'all. That respect y'all. But look what y'all doing. Look what y'all doing. Y'all got an ignorant woman on her live that dog you talk about you and y'all still feed this woman but something's wrong with her too everybody got their opinion Everybody not going to see things the way you see it. But y'all need to stop. Because y'all got innocent babies involved in this. And Cryer, you got a son. Baby Dion is not your only son. You got older kids, man, that love their dad. 
but they don't love the situation that you putting them in. You got a son that I live with every day that love the ground his dad walk on. But he's feeling some type of way now. And that's sad. From this boy going, from talking about his dad every day. This boy going from, he couldn't wait to get down there to his dad, to go visit his dad and his brother, to now it is what it is. And that's sad, man, that you taking your son joy away from him on how he feel about his dad. And I'm coming to you man to man. You tainting, you destroying <clears throat> the relationship and the bond that you and Darion have. All because of your other son's mom. And you know she's wrong. You know what she's about. You know she's a shit starter. When are you going to say enough is enough? When you going to say my kids mean everything to me? When you going to stop thinking everything is about Damien Cryer? When you going to stop that man? Huh? Everything is not about you and Erica, man. Y'all have children that love y'all. You have children that respect and love their daddy, man. But you making them you making them kids choose between being around their dad because they don't like this woman. So what you going to do, man? You shouldn't put your kids in a situation to where they have to choose between their father and this woman. And I'm keeping it 100, man. The real you in there's way. You're going to lose. You probably sitting there frowning up, talking crazy, talking about what he talking about. I don't give a care. You just hate. Whatever you saying about me. I don't care. All I care about is that boy feelings. All I care about is when that boy is happy. I do my part as a stepdad. But that boy love his dad. And I can see it man. You're not here. And I'm not saying that in no bad way. You're not here, so you don't see and hear what I see, or hear, so you don't see what I see and hear what I hear, man. That boy is starting to change. And you're going to lose him. And I'm telling you this from a father's, because I have kids too. And I chose one of my kids over one of my kids and damn near lost my babies. And I shouldn't have never did that. I should have stayed neutral and let my kids handle that between amongst them. But me being a dad, I tried to play both sides. Oh, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, you know. But I should have just stayed neutral and let them siblings handle it on their own. And came in as a father and tried to put a stop to it. But no. I tried to play both sides. And that's what you're doing. You're playing with Erica and you're playing on the fact that Darion is your child. So you think you, you can assess the situation. You get control of the situation. But you don't. Your child's going to be 15. Three years from now, he's going to be 18. you losing him, man. You lose.
losing it. And that's all I'm going to say. J. Michael out.